Lexi. Welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be a little bit different than usual. I have quite a bit of errands I need to run today. I want to take you guys with me. I want to go to TJ Maxx. I need a new like summer wreath, spring wreath. Um, where else do I want to go? I want to see if I have some time to go to Home Goods. Um, I also need to pop into Aldi. Ryan's sister actually just moved to Charleston. So we're going to be going all around helping her get some new furniture for her new apartment. And I thought I would take you guys along for the ride. I also need to pop in the kitchen and do some tidying in there before I go anywhere because that's kind of a mess. But yeah, that's what I have planned today. So we're just gonna be hanging out, going shopping, and then of course, whatever I buy from Aldi and TJ Maxx and wherever else we go, I will do a haul for you guys. So let me go ahead in the kitchen and do some tidying in there and then we're gonna be headed out the door. I ordered a laundry basket with wheels because I was tired of lugging a big laundry basket around the house. So Ryan's putting it together for me. It's massive. Found it on Amazon. I'll share you guys with it when it's completely done, but this is gonna be amazing because I always fold in the master bedroom and that's like really far from the laundry room. So now I can just roll it when I do laundry. Here's the kitchen, not too bad. Just like stuff everywhere, just need to put it away. So that's what we're gonna do. I usually do this when I come home from the gym, but I kind of did things backwards. I went to the gym, showered, and got ready before doing this. So yeah, I'm just picking up this mess from like breakfast and also some stuff from last night as well. So let's get all of this stuff put away. Also want to share with you guys my outfit for today. So I have these Abercrombie jeans. I just ordered a second pair of these and love them. They're so, so good. And then I have this little crop top. It's by Express. It's by their body contour line. And I own it in two colors. I want some more because it's just so comfortable. It can be tucked in the jeans as well or just be worn like how I kind of have it but it's so comfortable. I'm gonna add some accessories, I think, to this outfit, like some earrings, a necklace would be really cute, but just a really simple outfit, and I'll either throw on some sandals or maybe some Converse. I haven't quite decided yet, but such a comfortable outfit. All right, I just threw my favorite sweatshirt on. Felicity, you're gonna knock me down. She gets so excited when I film, um, but I threw the sweatshirt on, so that way I don't get anything on my shirt that I have, so I don't want to ruin it. But yeah, let me go do the kitchen. Okay, you guys, we're not gonna spend too much time in this kitchen. I just wanted to do a light little tidy so we can come home to a clean house when we're done with our shopping day. So I just gathered everything off the back counter, all the trash, all the dirty dishes. I like to bring everything to the island. I keep looking at the dogs. Ryan was playing with them if you keep seeing me smiling and clapping. But yeah, I bring all the dirty dishes from the back counters to the front and then I'm just loading the dishwasher. It was pretty full, so I was able to get a couple of things in there and then whatever I couldn't fit in there, I just went ahead and hand washed. Are you guys team hand wash or team dishwasher? You'll have to let me know down in the comments. I'm definitely team dishwasher. Throw it in there. I let the dishwasher do the work for me, but it was completely full. So we're gonna be doing some hand washing. I also wanted to let you guys know, if you're new here, I have my Amazon storefront linked down below for you guys. So that white spray bottle that I just used to spray the dishes that has Dawn Power Wash in it. And it's amazing because I no longer have to have that blue bottle on my counter. So definitely check out my storefront the silicone mat as well as those little pumps are all on my amazon storefront
hate when the dishwasher's full because I don't really mind hand washing all the dishes, but I hate drying and putting things away right away. Whereas the dishwasher, you can just kind of run the cycle and deal with it later. That's like the amazing benefits of putting things in the dishwasher, but we're gonna go ahead and put the dishes away because I hate clean dishes just sitting on the countertop. So once we get that put away, I'm going to dry my little drying mat and then we're gonna wipe down all of the counters in the kitchen. the Mrs. Myers multi-surface spray to wipe down all the counters. I believe this is the lilac scent. It smells amazing. If you guys have a countertop spray that you love using in your kitchen, you'll have to let me know because I want to pick up some new cleaning products. I've gone through so many, so I want to test out some new products. If you have a good one, leave it down in the comments for me. Okay, dishwasher is on, kitchen is nice and clean. It only took me like 15 or 20 minutes, not long at all. I just hate leaving a dirty house and having to come back to it. So we did the dishes, wiped the counters, didn't do any deep cleaning, just like surface level cleaning, but that looks so much better. So that way when I come home, I'll come home to a clean house. That's always the best. Watch out, watch out, I gotta show them the laundry basket. So this is the laundry basket on Wills. It had amazing reviews on Amazon. I'll link it down below for you guys. I really, really needed this because I'm just tired of having to lug laundry around. So, so happy with it. It looks amazing quality. Ryan did have to use his screwdriver to put it together, but um, it seemed that it only took them like 10 minutes to put together, so it wasn't too bad, but I love how massive it is, especially when I'm doing like multiple loads. Like, this is seriously perfect. I also wanted to let you guys know, I know I shared it over on Instagram as well, but my uh, marble chain links are back in stock. I always have them on my coffee table. I share them in an Amazon favorites video and they went out of stock so fast. So um, here they are and they've been out of stock for like a month or two now and they're back in stock and they're on sale. So I'll leave the link to these down below. They're massive, super good quality, beautiful marble. Like it looks so good on my coffee table. Okay guys, we're starting our shopping day. We ended up going to a few stores. So we are starting in TJ Maxx and you guys probably know that I own this waffle maker and I wanted to share it with you guys. It was $12.99 if you needed a waffle maker and these bamboo organizers are what I have in my drawers. It's amazing for organizing utensils. So highly recommend getting it from TJ Maxx. It had a really good price on that and I love stopping in the cutting board aisle. I always find some beautiful cutting boards they also make really good gifts because they have like ones with initials on it so that'd be a really cute gift to give somebody and then I want to do my bathroom linen closet so I was looking at some baskets I really like the ones that I was touching but didn't pick those up I'm gonna still be hunting for the perfect baskets They had so many beautiful vases. My favorite one is the one that I'm about to touch like right now, that one. Oh my gosh, it's gorgeous. I should have gotten it, didn't get it because I need a smaller vase to be able to store flowers. And I really loved this chain link. That'd be so cute on a coffee table. decorate for summer if so this little plant would be so so cute in the kitchen leaned up against some cookbooks like 
How cute would that be? I used to be the person to decorate for all seasons, but honestly, it was just taking up so much space in the garage. I wanted to share with you guys this bench. This is the bench that I have in my master bedroom, and it's probably like one of my most asked questions about where that bench is from. I got it from TJ Maxx. They still have it. It's right under $100. So head to your TJ Maxx, see if you can find it. They also had this one as well, and I loved that one too. But yeah, so I mainly just decorate for fall and Christmas because... It was just taking up so much space decorating for all of the seasons. But if you decorate for all the seasons, TJ Maxx is a really great place to come because they have really affordable home decor. And then usually in the center of the store, they have the larger furniture pieces here. So I just kind of wanted to share with you guys some of the furniture pieces they had on display this day. Stopped for lunch, got some fajitas, and now we're headed to Home Goods. And Home Goods is probably my favorite, favorite store. They had some really good pieces, especially if you needed some outdoor furniture. Like they had some really well priced outdoor furniture. And they had some beautiful coffee table books. I thought about getting this one. I didn't end up getting it, but it was really neutral and I liked the pictures inside. So come to Home Goods if you need some coffee table books. And we're also in need of an umbrella for when Ryan's grilling outside. I really liked this one, but I didn't like that it was red. And also we need one with a cover. And how beautiful is this console to mount a TV above that? It was $5.99.99 solid wood. That's the thing about home goods. Their prices are great for solid wood pieces. It may seem expensive, like why would I spend $600 on a furniture piece if I can go to Target and get it for 200? But when you're buying solid wood, you're gonna have to pay that price tag and it will last you a lifetime. This white buffet looked just like the one I have in my office. It was $7.99.99, super sturdy, high quality. I love this entry table. It had a marble top on top of it. If I had a spot for that, I would have gotten it because it was beautiful. I love home goods. They have so many unique finds in this Sherpa chair. I love Sherpa, but I didn't need any bar stools. And I also found a little white console, this one right here. I loved this. I thought that was so cute in an entryway or wherever. It was $249 and amazing quality. If my home was more boho, I would have definitely got that mirror. It was on sale, you guys. It was massive. It was so beautiful. Can you imagine like trying one clothes in front of this mirror? Like it was so big, but just didn't fit our decor. And how cool was this little egg chair? It was $399.99 and this chair right here, you guys, I loved. It was on sale for $150. Nothing was wrong with it, I checked. It was perfect and one of the ladies had just wheeled out the other one that had a set of two in the store. And then these alabaster lamps look just like my lamps on my nightstand. I actually love how modern and sleek they are, but we don't need any more lamps unless I would have snagged those. And look at this little cute Sherpa bench, it's for a kid's room. And these massive beads would be so cute on a coffee table. The last stop we went on was to Target. My sister-in-law ended up getting so much cute things from here, but I wanted to share with you guys these room sprays. You'll have to see which ones I picked up. They all smelled amazing. Then I stopped at the new Studio McGee furniture and I felt like the furniture was very, very similar from older collections. So nothing really caught my eye there, but they did have some cute stuff if you guys don't have anything from the older collections. Um, and then they had a lot of stuff on clearance, like some of these Studio McGee plants were on sale for $10. They were originally $15. And one thing that I did really love are these vases. I thought those would be so cute in the center of like 
like a dining table. I would love to have those, but I have something very similar, so I didn't pick them up. Hey guys, it's the next day. We got back super late last night, so I wanted to do a haul for you guys of everything I picked up. I didn't get too much, but I think I got some really good stuff. So let's start with Target first. So here's all the goodies I got from Target. All right, so first up, I actually already have this item, but I wanted to get a second one. It is this gold candle stand, and I love it to put candles on top of. I actually have one right here in my office, and I usually have a candle lit on top. Um, so I wanted another one for, I'm thinking the kitchen. Um, and then these candles fit perfectly on the stands. So I've been using just like a Bath and Body Works candle, but um, it's this like circle is massive. So I actually got candles to fit it perfectly. My sister-in-law works at um, a nail salon and they have this candle on top of the gold stand. So I had to copy it. Um, and it's the threshold candle and it is vanilla bean and amber. It smells amazing, you guys. So literally it fits perfectly and you can just light it on the stand. So I'm gonna have it like this in my office. And then I got another candle for the other gold stand I just shared with you guys. And this candle smelled really good too. I think this one's my favorite, but this one is soft cotton and it smells really good too. And again, to go on top of this gold stand. This one's like white and then the other one is kind of like a creamish color, kind of has like some pink undertones to it. But I definitely like the way the vanilla bean and amber smells better. But the cotton one smells really good too. And then the last things I got, I didn't get too much because honestly, I share with you guys a little bit of the Target collection. It's so similar to the other collection that I just like didn't feel like I needed anything from this collection. Um, but I did get these room sprays. All of the hearth and hand was 15% off. And I've been eyeing these room sprays for a while. I've told you guys I love my Castle Luna spray. The Castle Luna spray, I believe, is $20 maybe. And these were only $6.99 and they were 15% off. So, such a good deal. I got Meadow. That one smells amazing. And I'm just going to use this to like freshen up our home. Um, I also got this one and I love the bottle. This one is salt. Salt smells so good. So far, Meadow is my favorite. And then I also got Pumpus, and I loved this one in the store. This one's my favorite. Yeah, Pumpus is like my favorite one, but I just love the bottle. So I'm gonna keep one in my office. I'll probably keep one in the master bedroom, one in the family room, but they're so cute to just display. So that's all I got from Target. Let me share with you guys what I got from TJ Maxx. All right, TJ Maxx. I didn't get much from TJ Maxx, honestly. I didn't see a whole lot there. But first up, I shared this popcorn um, with you guys a couple of months ago. It's by Live Love Pop. It's the salt and vinegar, and it is so good. You guys got to pick this up. They have a few other flavors there, but this is like my go-to one. Every time I go to TJ Maxx, I pick up a bag. And then the other thing I got, I'm so excited about these. I've wanted some of these for a while and they're these wood bowls. So I just love them because you can do like smoothie bowls in these. You can do like grain bowls. We eat a lot of like grain bowls, little salads. Um, these were $7.99 each and they say a bamboo, 100% bamboo bowl. So that's what they look like. I thought they were such good quality and I just love the way these look stacked. We eventually do want to do some floating shelves in our living room, like above that black console. These would even be cute, like displayed on top, but definitely plan to use these. Um, Ikea has some similar ones if you guys live by an Ikea. I don't live by an Ikea, so I just picked them up from TJ Maxx, but they're such good quality. I can't wait to use these. And then the only other thing I picked up from TJ Maxx is this oversized Pong. I saw this in store. And I was like, oh my gosh, this looks so much fun. And it's pretty much just like beer pong if you guys have ever played that before. But it's these massive cups. Let me show you how big the cups are. And I don't even think you have to set it up on a table. I think you can just set it up on the ground. Um, but these are the cups. And you have to try to get the ball 
inside of the cups and it comes with two balls and the cups I'm like this is gonna be so much fun so we're definitely going to play this we spend so much time out in our lanai um in the warmer months so i know we're gonna get a lot of use out of this game and that was 24.99 for that game all right and i already shared this stuff over on my instagram account but in case you don't follow me over here i thought i would include it in this haul i got it last week i still need to wash everything and get it set up first up i got these cereal canisters and these were 6.99 they look just like the oxo ones but a fraction of the price I love that these just like lift up. So I'm gonna use these to store my cereals. So I got two of those. And then I also got these little canisters with the wood tops. They were on sale for $3.99, you guys, for two, because it's an old find. I think these got released last month at Aldi. Um, but yeah, so they had them clearance because they had quite a bit in the store. They needed to clear room for the new sale. So I just went ahead and got two packs of this. I'm like $3.99 for two of these like canisters. And I don't know if I said that, but these are glass. So super good quality. I actually own a set already from Aldi, and they are just amazing quality. So love these. I almost forgot this in the car. So I actually originally had this cart in um, the cart for me. I love this little weekend toe. I thought it was just like so, so cute. Love the design on it. It was $19.99 from Aldi, of course. And then I started to think, I was like, I can put together a little Mother's Day basket for my mom. She's actually gonna be in town. Usually I wouldn't do something like this for her if I'm having to ship something because this would be really expensive to ship. But since she's coming in town anyway, I can just give it to her. So that was just perfect. And then I picked up a whole bunch of stuff from Aldi and like stuffed it in here and I'm not done with it yet I'm gonna add like some gift wrap at the bottom it's gonna be really cute but yeah this tote was $20 and then I also got her one of these little water um, containers as well I thought this would be so nice for her to have um, and then what else did I get her I got her this card this was 99 cents and this was $10 by the way um, and then I got her a really cute little pajama set. It comes with a long sleeve shirt, a pair of shorts, and also like a little eye cover. So I thought that was so, so cute. And then what else did I get in here? I actually got her a set of these little hammered glasses to go with, that's out his focus, to go with this guy. How cute, and then I got me one as well. I need to actually put this one over here. That one's for me. And then what else do I have? And then also she's always loving my little silicone mats whenever she comes over. I put these on my baking sheets whenever I bake. These were $5, so I got her one of these guys as well. And I think that's all I added in there. So yeah, I'm gonna put a whole bunch of like gift wrap at the bottom to kind of raise it up and then put all of this stuff in here and I'll probably add like a candle and then that will be her Mother's Day gift. So that's a little idea for you guys for next year or you can even do this for a birthday or something like that or a Christmas present too would be really nice. Um, I will usually either do a bag or a basket but she already has a lot of baskets so I went ahead and did this bag and I think she'll really like it. But yeah, that is everything I picked up. I hope you guys enjoyed coming shopping with me. Give this video a thumbs up if you enjoy it. I hope all of the mothers have a beautiful Mother's Day and I'll see you guys very soon with a brand new video. Bye.